Our next guest is a national fitness expert guru, and I'm excited to be so excited to have her on the show. I'm especially excited about this individual because what she's doing to inspire others to live a life of wellness and success. She's a, as we said, a national fitness expert, spokesperson, health and wellness reporter, columnist, and author. Please welcome president and founder of Get Body Beautiful, Miss Andrea Riggs is in the building. Welcome to the show. Hey, what's going on, Clark? How you doing? Man, I am fired up and ready to go. What about yourself? Hey, it's always a good day. I've been hanging out here in Atlanta with uh, about 400 women over at Spelman College. So, you know, I'm all pumped up because, hey, here's the good news, Clark. Despite what the statistics say about black women's health, I'm convinced that black women care about our health. So so you can't tell me we don't because I just saw it. Well, you saw 400 women in one room getting busy. Getting, that, that in and of itself is no joke. I'm excited to see that uh, our the statistics, excuse me, that are being thrown about aren't necessarily always true. Well, you know what? The statistics, you know, really, they say that 78% of African-American women are actually overweight. And so you take a look at that, that means like 8 out of 10 women in a room. And so, you know, to actually step into a venue and see that, that those statistics may may or may not hold true, but the fact that these are women who, they're in town really um, more on corporate leadership, you know, trying to figure out how to do well in business, how to do well in corporate America. But I think women are realizing that you cannot be successful in other areas of your life without actually focusing in on your health. So that's kind of that conversation, like, okay, with everything else going on, relationships, does it affect your relationship, does it affect your job? And I'm here to tell you that yes, because it all it, it's all relevant. Wow, hey, Adrian, I gotta I, I want to throw this question in because you hear it uh, bantered about a lot. The word obesity. What is the definition of someone who is classified as obese? I think um, obesity. When when you think about the word obesity, that means that they are over you know 30 percent of their goal and desired weight. So when you talk about, you know, being 10% overweight, that doesn't really put you in the obesity category. When you start saying 30%, you are definitely in that category because, you know, obesity is essentially a serious medical condition where when you're actually in the obese category, not only um, does it have an adverse effect on your health, it leads to the idea that, you know what, you can actually reduce your life expectancy. So if people start equating obesity with how long am I going to live, I think that those statistics statistics will actually get a little bit more attention. Mm. Amen to that. The word has got a highly negative connotation. We used to just call it big bone back in the day. Hey, I, <laughs> hey, I know you started Get Body Beautiful in 1998. Okay. And uh, you've been recognized for your excellence by national publications, radio, and TV. What are you and your team doing that sets you so far above the rest? I think um, what has probably set us so far above the rest is that, you know, we, we are taking this as a practical and systematic approach to how you actually get healthy. And, you know, our strategy has been, you know, definitely – you know, partner with the media. This started for me probably four years ago when I actually was doing the Atlanta Biggest Loser, the show here in NBC. And so when you realize that, you know, you can reach more people, I think our strategy has been to continue to reach more people by working with, you know, media professionals like yourself. Then when you reach them, let, let's, let's, be, let, let's be clear about what we're trying to do. We want to make sure that we increase awareness. We want to educate people. We want to give them information and tools so that it's not some, you know, this is not a joke, this is a very serious matter. And so, you know, if we can reach people, it's just making sure that we give them that content um, that really reaches them right where they are. Because you don't, have to, you don't have to have this huge, you know, drastic change. It's like if you meet people where they are, we're trying to give them a systematic approach, and that's what Get Body Beautiful is about, small changes in lifestyle, nutrition, and fitness. So you can't tell me that, that, that you have to be in great shape 
to do this plan. You know, you just have to say, I'm ready to start and do something different. Yeah.